Hello fellow grower and welcome to my channel, The Late Grower. Now today I'd like to show you my uh, grapes in containers. They are over there. Okay, but before we can go near those uh, grapes in containers, I have to wear this uh, hard hat. Okay, so it looks like I'm going to a construction site, but no. I uh, just need this for uh, protection because uh, you would see there is this huge chesa tree serving as uh, shade here in this portion of my garage and uh, the uh, grapes in containers are uh, below them okay and this large chesa tree has lots of fruits right now ripe, ripening lots lots of uh, fruits and uh, those fruits have been dropping okay as you can see here there is one fruit here that dropped earlier there is another one another one there and another one there so I need this uh, hard hat as a protection whenever I go there okay so you don't you just don't know when uh, those uh, ripe chestnut fruits are going to drop okay so let me put on this hard hat and we can go to the grapes in uh, containers okay so uh, here we are this is one of them this is a uh, Catauba variety of uh, grapes and it is growing in this uh, 80 liters or 20 gallon uh, container okay I made this uh, sort of uh, trellis to grow this uh, Catauba on okay so you see I don't have much space so, so I uh, figure I can uh, grow them using this PVC PVC pipes with the uh, galvanized uh, wire okay serving as the uh, trellis the height is about uh, five feet and five inches I have him here I have them here this one is a uh, red cardinal uh, variety at least that's what the dealer said <laughs> okay so you can see here red cardinal variety this one I'm sure is a red cardinal variety because I got this from a reputable uh, dealer uh, Bison Farms in uh, Quezon City uh, they are inside the Ninoy Aquino uh, Parks and Wildlife in Quezon City okay and beside it is a strawberry uh, plantlet that I'm also uh, growing okay as you can see, the uh, trellis have wires where the uh, main vertical as well as the uh, laterals will later grow on. Okay. Here's another one. Okay. They are still uh, small, about two months old. And uh, I'm already gui uh, guiding them into this uh, wire. To grow along this wire okay here is another one okay if you've noticed uh, I put them in a shaded uh, area they receive only morning sunlight uh, because and especially uh, those in containers over there, they have this uh, shade or uh, roof placed because uh, every afternoon it rains here in uh, my place, in Metro Manila, so they cannot be exposed to too much uh, rain, so they need to be uh, shaded or at least there must be roof on top of them. Okay, so that's why it has a roof. But, uh, if it is uh, not raining, I remove the roof. Okay, so uh, those are my uh, grapes in containers. 
and uh, in a few months I'm going to give an update on how uh, this project goes. Okay, I, I uh, don't have or we do not have pixie grapes here in uh, the Philippines yet, I think. That's why uh, I settled on growing the ones that are uh, endemic or uh, thriving here in uh, this country, the Catawba and Red Cardinal Grapes. Okay, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye-bye!